what is going on you quality lot quality xa here today and today i am bringing you guys a brand new video on destiny so today we are talking about some of the brand new swords which are going to be in the game now whether these are legendary or exotic i'm not 100 percent sure on but you do have a few new sword types and uh, some of them look like they do different elemental damages anyways let's get right into this so first off we are starting with the titan sword so as you guys can see here we've actually got freeze frame and um, this was after the titan activated his super and you can see just for a split second he is holding this brand new i don't know how to explain it it looks similar to the rays lighter in shape but the way it's done is just so so unique i'm not sure if it's an ornament on this sword but you can sort of see some bandages going around. It looks like a really powerful sword, but you can't see any elemental damage on this one as such. But nevertheless, a really nice looking sword indeed, and certainly one I would be rooting for getting. So, <laughs> yeah, pretty awesome. Next up, we have got a hunter sword. Now, this was in the trailer, but as you guys can see, you can see the hunter running towards which looks like a Cabal Empire guard. And you can see the hunter, as he is running, he's sort of holding this sword in a very special way. He's only got one hand in the air, and he's literally holding the sword in one hand as if he would, if he was really using a katana. So, um, yeah, you sort of see him jump in the air and do a little swipe as he goes down. But it does look really cool indeed. And certainly, I would love to have this one purely because of the shape of a katana. The katana is honestly one of the best looking swords in the world in my opinion um screw having a broadsword and that a katana is honestly something that ninjas use honestly and then last but not least we have this titan now he's actually slamming with this sword but as you see when he does slam it actually creates some sort of void damage where the enemies just disappear or it looks like void anyways and it was actually in pvp which this was recorded in but yeah such a big sword this one you can see as well where the handle is. It almost looks like it's got two angel wings on. But again, looks really, really cool indeed. And I'm definitely a big collector for these swords. And now we actually have this image here. So as you guys can see, this is what you get if you pre-order the digital deluxe edition or the normal deluxe edition or limited edition. And also the collector's edition, I believe. But you can see here in the premium digital content, you actually have what looks to be an emote, an emblem, and a brand new type of sword, which looks absolutely epic indeed. The colours, what this sword has, white, gold, and silver, just honestly, it looks phenomenal. I, I can imagine this looking absolutely incredible in-game as well. But nevertheless, I would really want this out of all of them. And the great thing about it is I have pre-ordered the collector's edition so I can look forward to using this on day one. Fingers crossed, unless it's hidden in some sort of vault somewhere um, which has been blown up. That would be just my luck. But nevertheless, looks really cool. But anyways, guys, that's pretty much the video. If you did enjoy this video, please do leave a thumbs up. Be much appreciated. And if you guys would like to win a Destiny 2 beta code, comment in that comment section below. Leave a like and subscribe if you guys are new around here. And yeah, let me know in that comment section below what your favourite sword in this was. Definitely, for me, it would either be the Katana or this last sword with the Digital Deluxe Edition. But yeah, that's it, guys. Peace out, and I'll see you guys in the next one.